from measuring and weighing to charting and graphing. This isn't your ordinary science experiment at Saddlebrook Elementary School. I tied it together today with the Crawdad Olympics where the coaches, the students, had to take the knowledge that they gained over the week from the different activities we've done and use it to be able to get the Crawdads to perform the best of their abilities in the different uh, Olympic events like weightlifting, the strength test, um, swimming. Fourth grade teacher Robert Zook says it's all part of an effort to provide a hands-on learning experience for students. It's a more inquiry-based, project-based learning instead of your traditional worksheets or standardized testing. Kids don't always have the same result with what they do, but that's good because they learn in different ways. And the kids are becoming the experts and they share their knowledge with us. And students are not only learning important skills, they're also developing special bonds with each other. And it's that kind of camaraderie that helps inspire learning and bonding, not just for students, but for parents as well. I had a really fun time coming down and, and going to each of the stations and, uh, and just experiencing this with Wyatt, right? Yep. Yeah. It's fun. It seems that this is a really um, neat little experiment with the crawdads and everything else. Even though your guy wouldn't hold the string, he did pinch the biggest, uh, uh, the biggest uh, cylinder. Some of the activities involved measuring the distance a crawdad could walk, charting its weight and strength, and recording and graphing those results. Some students even conquered their own fears. I was scared of picking her up, but now I'm not that scared anymore. Me too. The experiments not only encourage students to use critical thinking skills, but they also inspired a passion for learning. This has given them the joy of learning, lifelong learning. And it's also teaching them how to think in critical ways, so I just fill in the blank worksheets and standardized tests, things like that. So it goes beyond that, and it's just really giving kids a lot of joy of learning back that maybe we've taken away from all the other stuff we've done with them.